There you go. I'm in it. All right. Well, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna um, when I when I load this, I'm gonna send Coach um, Philip the link. And when you see it tomorrow, I say, Coach Philip, can you text me that link so you can see what you're doing? What I was telling you about from how instead of going straight one time you was over here, instead of going straight after you release you was over here, and then when the one's going high, you can tell you release it from right here instead of releasing right here. All right. And as you, like you said, you haven't pitched in a year, so don't get down on yourself. We probably need you a couple of games. It may be one inning, it may be two innings. Throughout the course of the season, you may be hot and you probably can finish a game. It's just going to be on you, okay? We're not out here to push you, to push you, and hurt you. But if we need you, we're going to need you to pitch. All right? That's fair? Right. You're welcome. out here that ball can either go that way carry or go this way but if you stay straight every time every time with your with your, with your um, release and pushing off with with that leg and coming through you're gonna be all right we're not worrying about too much of the change-ups and all of that we're worrying about the speed and the distance you can get it to the plate because you can have nothing but a fastball but if you can if, if you can aim inside outside and make it rise we good and kill them every now and then with a change up we good but the velocity and all that and the control is on you. Because once you get in that circle, we're not out there with you. Only thing coach can do is call you call the pitch either inside or outside. Try to keep releasing it here. It seems like when you're releasing, you're trying to re like, like push it towards the glue. Like a, like a yo-yo, not a yo-yo. Yeah. But let it go right here. Let it go my right mom, there. My mom wants me to come here and then follow through. Yeah, they but. all want me to follow through. So but that's see, what I'm to do. Yeah, even if you come, when you're releasing it here, your arm gonna naturally go. But it seems like after you getting it, it's like you push it. See, that's a lot different. See, all of them, we'll, we'll, we'll take them though. Because you open you wide instead of straight ahead. Even even when you hear however you start off, as you go in your windup, when you when you drop, you should be from straight ahead. Yeah, I don't know. That, that's why I'm not gonna I'm not I'm not gonna tell you how to stance. I just know on your delivery you should be straight ahead. Because maybe he thinking when you standing wide, you coming wide. That's probably why he's saying close. So when you release, you already be closed and straight ahead. That's the only thing I can think of. And he said I wasn't lined up with home plate, that I was 
like to the right or to the left. So that's why I was throwing my pitches either right or left. Let me know when you're ready to go in the net. Hey, you outfielders need to be talking to her too. I know you're going to back up, but y'all got to communicate too. I thought you was going to tell me when you came in here. Oh. If you're standing like that, it looks like you straighten up right there. Yeah, and then my mom used to say, we went to like three pitching coaches and they all talked about this, or we're coming to this, and I could never get the ball. I could do it. Mm -hmm. So I start here, I sit here, but they say now you're just slapping to the track. You straight ahead right there. Yeah, well, first of all, it's just fastball. She wants fastball, change up, rise, drops, turn. I, I, I understand that, but the deal is your approach and everything still have to be the same. Look where you at now. Stay right there. Look where you at. To your right. Give me 10 pitches. All fastball. We're worried about change up the rise, all that right now. What was that? That was low? Yeah. Look, when you when you when, that's where your hand was at. Yeah, my hand signature's cut up far off, too. So I wasn't even looking, and I knew that was low. My pitching coach is coming open. You still go to your pitching coach? Why not? I was like Katarina's coach, which was... I was in 10 years. But why you stop going? My mom couldn't afford it. Oh. Okay. And I haven't been to a fishing coach since because every time we're there, I say, like, oh, we need $40 a week mm. or 45 a week. And my mom doesn't can't afford that a week. Neither can I. I had a job and I couldn't do it. Thank uh -huh.